Welcome to Physics Analysis. Today we shall be discussing about electroscope. Electroscope. Right. <coughs> electroscope. What is electroscope? So, but your electroscope is a device. First of all, let me write. a device which is used to detect the presence and nature of charge right so what is what is electroscope electroscope is a device it is nothing but a device which is used to find out or to detect the presence and nature of charge by using electroscope you can find out presence of charge and nature of charge right whether the object really is electrified or not whether the object is really charged or not and what kind of charge if it is charged, whether it is positive charge or negative charge, using electroscope you can find out. Now the thing is, the electroscope is the most gold leaf electroscope, right? Gold leaf. call it GLP actually electroscope जो है ना बच्चों is of two type right number one Gold leaf, gold leaf electroscope. Number two, pith ball electroscope. Right. Actually, electroscope are of two types. Gold leaf electroscope, pith ball electroscope. But let me tell you one thing: gold leaf electroscope is the most sensitive electroscope as compared to pith ball electroscope. So now let us better discuss gold leaf electroscope, right? <coughs> gold leaf electroscope. Gold leaf. I do repeat everyone electroscope is what electroscope is a device which is used which we use to detect the presence and the nature of charge the electroscope jo hai are of two type but the most commonly electroscope used electroscope is gold leaf electroscope right now what about gold leaf electroscope so first of all what to say about gold leaf electroscope so I can say a type of a type of electroscope, right? A type of electroscope that consists of two gold leaf, right? to detect the presence and nature of charge right 
right is known as gold leaf electroscope so what you what is gold leaf electroscope a type of electroscope that consists of two gold leaf what you let me clear let me let me tell you one thing in presence of gold leaf you can you can you can you can use aluminium leaf also but for more precise we are taking gold leaf right now a type of gold leaf electroscope nut consist of two gold leaf to detect the presence and the nature of electric charge so we call it gold leaf electroscope right actually gold leaf electroscope jo hai na gold leaf electroscope was invented by one physicist was there his name was <coughs> abraham bennett bennett in the year in the 1787 right bachcho gold leaf electroscope was invented by abraham bennett in the year of 1787 remember that so this is what about gold leaf electroscope if someone will ask you what about gold leaf electroscope what do you mean by gle gold leaf electroscope simply you can say a type of electroscope uh, that consists of two gold leaf to detect or in order to detect presence and nature of electric charge right now let's see the construction of gold leaf electroscope so written everyone i am rubbing construction of gold leaf electroscope construction so it consists of two gold leaf right suspended from a metal stem so this metal stem is generally made by brass in a vacuum glass jar okay connected with a metal of this otherwise you can write better cap now one more thing the this glass jar hai na the glass jar is grounded other thing to the ground with the help of with the help of metal foil or what so that the two halves of gold are protected by external electrical
this stuff, son. As you can see in this figure. Return. See, what what to write in construction of a gold leaf of this globe? Better you can write it. It consists of two gold leaf suspended from a metal stem, generally made by brass, in a vacuumed glass jar. Right? You can see here. Connected with a metal cap, in a one end jo hai, one end of this uh, metal stem is connected to the uh, metal cap and in the other end, the lower end is connected with a two gold leaf, gold leaf, right? And most important thing, this glass jar, jo hai na, the glass jar is a grounded. Mm, with the help of a metal foil so that uh, the two leaves the gold leaf I am talking about huh, will be protected by thermal electrical disruption ok ok so this was your construction now what about the working of an gold leaf leptoscope let's see working So in working we have two part. One is identification of of presence of charge. Presence of charge. Right. Identification of presence of charge so <clears throat> what to write under identification of presence of charge see the object to be tested right the object to be tested is touched to the metal cap and if we see the divergence in the leaf then <laughs> then the object uh, which is being touched that is charged object right and if no change in the leaf, that means the, the object is said to be uncharged. So you can write for detection of charge the body which is To be tested is charged with metal cap. Now the thing is now if the two leaves diverse then the object or the body is said to be <laughs> charged right understood everyone see actually we are going to find out whether the ob whether the object is charged or not suppose this one I want to find out whether this chalk holder is charged or not. So what to do? Simple term. Okay, and then I will see whether there is any divergence, any change in this in the two leaves or not. If I can see the divergence in the two leaves, that means this one has charged. This one is charged body. Otherwise, this is neutral, this is uncharged, right? And you can add and if there is no change in the two leaves 
then the body is uncharged right so this is the first part this is how you can check whether the object is charged or not just by looking the in under just by seeing the divergence okay if the gold leaf shows the divergence that means the object is charged body that means that means the body is if the body to be touched ah uh, is charged one otherwise neutral uncharged now let's see the second part that is ident identification of nature of charge so for that i will rub this one note it down okay now see working under second part working of electroscope what is going on second part so what is second part identification of identification of nature of charge right nature of charge see <clears throat> so bachcho how to uh, how to find out what is the nature of charge by using electroscope clear see when a charged body when a charged body is touched with an already charged electroscope and the charge on the body is of opposite sign as the charge on electroscope then if converge right so in this concept one can check the nature of charge how when a charged body see for this na already we will first of all we will charge the body leaf microscope now see this one is this one i am going to test whether it is positive charge or negative charge so simply i will what i will do this one i will touch with the metal cap and we'll see whether uh, the whether the leaf converge or diverge if it will converge that means the charge in both the object is of opposite kind means opposite sign means uh, if uh, if i know electroscope is positive that means it will it will definitely negative if the gold leaf electroscope is negative charge then this one will be positive see convergence means what opposite kind right are <coughs> there when a charged body is a touched with and already charged electroscope and the charge on the body is of same kind Okay, is on 
in a close call. Then the two leave diverge. So, but you simply will see whether the leave diverge or converge. If the leaf converge, that means what the uh, that means the object and the electroscope both are of opposite sign. Then it is converging. If we can see uh, the divergence in the leaf, that means what? With an already charged electroscope. So this charged electroscope, do you know now whether it is positive charged electroscope or negative charged electroscope? You want to know whether this one is positive or negative. But the nature of, but the charge present on electroscope, what the electro, this electroscope is positive charge. Now I want to know this one is negative or positive. So how do I come to know? I will simply touch the metal cap of the electroscope. And if I will see the divergence, that means this one is also positive. And that is why now diverge, the leaf diverge. Consequently, when electroscope is negative charge, and this one I know, this one is also negative. Then what will happen? Negative, negative means is of same sign, same kind, same kind means diverge. Opposite kind means converge. So this is how we can find out the nature of uh, the nature of uh, charge present on your body. <laughs> Thank you.